Good morning guys and welcome back. So today we're going to be testing out two new Bounden Zone cleaning products. Now if you know me, I actually love Bowden's. Um They make absolutely awesome car cleaning products. Car cleaning products, not four-wheel drive cleaning products. Now I've been using them on the four-wheel drive and they are fantastic. But they've never made a dedicated four-wheel drive cleaning product before. You know, going four-wheel drive you're getting muddy, sandy, salty, all that. And it's really hard to clean. Bowden Zone's products do make it a lot easier. Uh, but they've never had a dedicated four-wheel drive cleaning product until now. So if you guys ever used the uh, snow job before, it's fantastic. You get that beautiful white shirt of snow on the car, it takes off all that dust, grime before you do your normal two-bucket wash. Now they've brought out this new mega snow job. Woohoo! Fantastic. They actually got a four-wheel drive on the front of it covered in snow. Now it is a Land Cruiser, should be a Jeep, but we're not going to hold down to that. Then you should change that to a Jeep, maybe, maybe that one. But they've just released a new Mega Snow product. Now, uh, price-wise of this, um, I got this from Super Cheap Auto. It was $29.99, which is fantastic. It's a one-litre bottle, so that's going to last a long time. $29.99. Now, as you as you probably think, why is it more ideal for four-wheel drives? Now, I'm not up to the know how, but I think it's got a higher pH level in it, so it's ideal for breaking down uh, dirt, grime stuff like that onto your four-wheel drives. Now on the back, heavy-duty foam for dirtier weekends. Now more heavy-duty snow foam, ideal for a weekend of bush bashing the four-wheel drive. Dirty bikes as well as boat jet skis, vans and trucks. Woohoo! Now the one thing that got me really excited about this, um, just down here says anti-rust and salt removal ingredients, ideal for four-wheel drives, watercrafts and even off-road caravans. Um, this will not remove any coatings, uh, ceramic coatings and stuff like that, which is awesome. Now, last weekend we were up the beach for Great Top of State and we got sand, salt water and stuff all over the Jeep. Now, I've been waiting. Now, I've been hosing it down. Don't hate me. I have been hosing it down to get it nice and clean. But look at the amount of sand that we got from underneath the Jeep. Now, that is disgusting. A big pile of sand. So, I've been waiting to use this product. Now, the second product we'll be using today. Now, on the snow, Mega Snow Job itself, it says... Use with a where was it? Um, important mega snow job needs to be used with a pressure washer over 1800 psi. Now we do have the gurney just there, so we might at the end of the video do a run through of the mega snow and the gurney. But I want to be using this new product now. It says not ideal, so keep that in mind. I'll be using it myself. You guys don't have to use it with the frother. Now the frother is the other new product from Bowden Zone. Now, normally you'd be using the, this is ideal with the snow job um, and other formulas. Um, they do recommend not using it with the mega snow. We will be cheating today. Sorry, Dan. We are going to see how good it is with the frother um, on the Jeep to get rid of that dirt, sand, and mud. Because um, if you've ever cleaned the underside of your Jeep before, there's not a lot of room. With not a lot of room, it's really hard to get underneath there with a pressure washer. Especially if not up on blocks or jack stands, it's really hard to get under there with the pressure washer to get all that salt, dirt, and stuff out. Um, and sometimes with the pressure washer, it's kind of just pushing dirt and salt further to where you don't want it. So I'll be using it with the uh, frother to get up into these tight areas, into the chassis rails itself, um, and we're going to see. I know Dan. I know Dan's probably watching this at the moment, and thinking. Why is he using it with the frother? I just wanted to test it. Now you guys don't have to use it with the frother. Now the frother, ideally you'll be using this with the snow job as like a pre-cleaner. Uh, now the frother is ideal. Uh, what it is, is a, is a pump system. Pump it up. Um, and then you can spray it. Um, and you can also, it's also got an awesome release valve on the back of it. It's got a nice little um, H2O level. We'll be filling it to 1.3 litres and um, then adding our mega snow to 1.5 litres. Um, and ideally this would be perfect for someone travelling around Australia, New Zealand, wherever that they don't actually have access to a pressure washer itself. So if you guys want to use the mega snow, don't doubt the pan, don't doubt the pan. Um, if you guys want to use the snow job uh, to give you a four-wheel drive a pre-clean before you do your hand wash, this would be perfect. Chuck it on the back of the Jeep, chuck it on the back of the four-wheel drive. If you're doing Cape York and stuff like that, um, you're getting that red dirt all over your car. It's so, it, I've seen people with it, it's apparently really hard to get off. So this would be ideal, chuck it on the back of your Jeep, um, your four-wheel drive, take it to one of those wash bays, 
That way you can do a awesome pre-clean. Or if you're like me um, and your son's upstairs sleeping and actually you can't use a pressure washer because it's going to be too loud, wake him up. That's ideal. Really quiet, but you can still get that satisfying snow job um, and get that pre-clean out of the way. So we're going to be filling this up. Um, now this was actually on sale at uh, Repco, not super cheap auto. Um, this was on sale at Repco for $35. Normally it's $49.99. Still a really good price. Um, and one of the cool things about it is uh, you can actually change the nozzles inside it to get a different foam thickness. Um, you can do like a dry foam, dry is foam, dry wet, wettest foam. That way you can make it ideal to your situation how you actually like your foam, which is really cool. Um, so I've gone with a really dry foam. That's just how I like it. Um, we're going to spray this on, then we're going to do our normal two bucket wash. We are going to start from underneath the front of the Jeep first, get that all nice and clean, get all that salt and stuff out. Um, as always, I'll be leaving a links for the products down in the description below, so if you want to check them out, you can either buy them from Repco, Super Cheap Auto, or straight from Bowden's if you guys live in America. Now this will be ideal, the mega snow for if you live in somewhere that snows and they've got salt on the road. <laughs> anti rustler and salt removal ingredients, come on guys, get onto this stuff, this is going to be fantastic. So, check you guys on the tripod, we can start cleaning the front of the car and then we can move on to the sides and see how thick the mega snow in the froth will be and then we'll probably put in the pressure washer um, and see the difference. <laughs> Get inside those cheesy rails. Nice of foam. Now, I didn't actually realize how dirty the Jeep was until I put that foam on. You can check out all that crap there. Just pretty much breaking off. Oh, you didn't actually realize how dirty your car is to use a good cleaning product. Wow. Look how yuck that is. Yep. So that foams up so well, even though you're not supposed to use it with the frother, it's foaming up so well. So we're letting that sit on, you can see all that dirt breaking off. We're going to rinse that off with the hose, and then we're going to get started on that door, and we're going to see how well the mega foam actually breaks down that dirt on the door, so how well it actually pulls it off. Oh, so far, so bloody good. But didn't realise how dirty my car actually was. Thank you. 
All right, so that's pretty much it for today, guys. If you like this video, smash that like button. If you haven't already, smash that subscribe button. In the next video, we'll be doing a one near review of the Mr. Black from Bowden Zone on the trim. So make sure you guys stay around for that to see how it's lasted over the year. I'm going to tell you now. Have a look for the next video. But if you guys like these products, I'll leave a link to them all down in the description below. Pretty happy with them. For the price they are and how well they clean, how well they get out of dirt, salt, sand, and keep your car looking pretty damn good. So pretty happy with the products, guys. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time.